Hi YouTube, it's OJSamurai6 here, and I'm here to tell you about the Dell Police Grand Championship Tournament. Um, if you do not live in Gal Police, you sh do not have to watch this video, as it does not concern you at all. Um, so, I finally got the answer that uh, the question that I have been asking for months upon months upon months when is summer break over for high school and younger? Um, I know college, we get about another week off than them. But the answer to my question is that school for the high schoolers starts on August 20th. That is a Thursday. To be honest, I wish they started on the 24th of Monday or sometime later, because then that would give you guys an extra week. <laughs> um, so that means if you know the Galapagos Grand Championship, that's the tournament where you get six check marks and you get your invite. Um, that means we still have the 17th, the 24th, the 31st, the 7th, and the day of. There will, in fact, be a last minute qualifier. Now, don't be under the impression that the last minute qualifier means if you win, then you automatically get your invite. That is false. It is not like um, the last minute qualifiers before nationals. It is just a normal locals where you're trying to get your invites. It's the same exact thing. Um, if you get second through fourth place, you get a check mark. If you get first place, you get two check marks. Um, yeah, it's exactly the same. Um, so, repeating myself, um, it's on August 14th. How it will go is the last minute qualifier will start at 12 o'clock. And unlike other tournaments, the matches will be timed um, to ensure that the tournament is completely over by the time that um, everybody else gets there. That's that's the reason it's going to be timed. So it is very important that you keep track of your life points. Very, very important. So do not make those mistakes. Um, maybe you could bring some paper or something. But um, how the tournament is going to go is it will be one of those everybody versus everybody so take the number of people that have their invite and then minus that by one and that's how many rounds say there was fifth uh not 50 16 people that got their invite everybody would verse everybody so there would be 15 matches although if there were that many people we would probably make it smaller because then we'd be there for quite a while um and then it will go to the top cut, um, more, more than likely going to be top four. Um, that's actually something I wanted to go over. Um, as of right now, there are only two people that have their invite, me and Levi. Um, if you want to look at this, if there's um, one of those by their names, it means they have their invite. Closest anybody has to getting their invite is five, and then there's Tristan with four, and then everybody else has two or less, which, um, that's kind of sad, you guys were that lazy this summer, um, if I do this again, I might make it that you only need four check marks, but if that were the case, I would make the prizes not as good, because then you wouldn't have to put in as much effort as, um, six check marks. But um, here's another thing. If you do not have your invite yet, or um, say you don't have a single check mark, um, and you have five locals left, and you need six check marks, so you could say, oh, I'm one off. But if there are less than six people that have their check marks um, on August 7th, which August 7th is the week before, last minute qualifier in the official Gallup Police Grand Championship, there will in fact be the next week on multiple days, another local, uh, other locals for you to get your chance. 
say for example, no promises, but for ex the, the, this will be me. But for example, it would be maybe there would be locals on Monday, Wednesday, Thursday. It's just an example. Um, but yes, if there are less than six people that get their invite, there will be more locals the week before because I really want it to be a good crowd. Um, and I gotta be honest, you guys were kind of lazy this season. <laughs> um, barely showing up, but. <sighs> um, let's see, what else did I want to say? I'm gonna pause it and then I'm gonna think about what else I wanted to say. Okay, continuing on. Um, a lot of the people in Gala Police have very low self-esteem. When I say that, I mean they really don't believe in themselves, which that's very bad, because when you don't believe in yourself, being able to accomplish anything, um, then you won't. Now, I'm probably going to do another one of those videos of how to get better at Yu-Gi-Oh! Um, I actually have a lot of this stuff thought up in my head, but I haven't written it down yet. That's, that's the thing. Um, I also got to make sure it's stuff I haven't said in previous videos. Um, but there's kind of just two ways, two things. You, you know how when you activate polymerization, you fuse two useless monsters to make something good? That's how you get better at Yu-Gi-Oh! You got to fuse using the right 40 to 60 card deck and fuse putting the right amount of time and effort into it. And that is how you will become better at Yu-Gi-Oh! It will do a lot for you. Say, for example, um, Ethan, um, he's put a lot of time into going to tournaments in the past to... Um, He's been to almost every single regionals I've been to. Um, there's a very small numbers he hasn't been to that I've been to. Um, but he wasn't using the right deck. But then he made you send use, which I suggest to him time upon time upon time again. I'm just, Ethan, if you make you send use, you will top the Dragon Duel Nationals. He finally listened to me. And he topped the Dragon Bull Nationals. It's easy. And then you kind of just got to do what's right. You got to you got to try hard, and you got to be using the right deck. That is how to become better. And you also got to feel confident in yourself. That's another thing. So feel confident in yourself getting your invite to the Galapagos Grand Championship. It will be worth it. So I will keep you guys updated if there will be um, tournaments the week before. Um, say for ex again, another example, Monday, Wednesday, Thursday. I don't know. It depends on how many check marks everybody has. But don't give up, guys. You're almost there. And it'll be worth it. Okay, I forgot to say the most important thing. The last minute qualifier will start at 12 p.m., just as a reminder. I know I already said that. And the only people that can enter the last minute qualifier are people that do not yet have their invites. So if you already have your invite, don't even bother trying to enter. Now, the Galapagos Grand Championship, which is what you're all fighting to get your invite for, that will start at 2 p.m. 2 p.m. on Friday, August 14th. Thank you.